I thank God for giving me the chance to meet a man that loves me so much. Not everyone has the chance to meet their one true love, but I did in an early age without trying hard. To have you as my husband is a blessing, and you make me the luckiest woman ever. story is uh, we're in a long distance relationship and uh, one of the support sites had these bracelets uh, available and it's to signify your relationship is not just what people think which is a fake relationship it's real and so each person wears one to show they're they're linked to someone and it just says, love knows no distance. Because distance doesn't matter. I want a library full of our stories. A ship to keep our memories afloat I wanna hit rewind and play back a hundred times The moment when our hearts aligned La 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 I never thought I would ever meet the perfect woman for me until I met you. You gave me hope and love and kindness when those things were lacking in my life. You stole my heart while I wasn't looking and made me feel whole and complete. Of course, and I cannot stand here in front of you before God and not say what a beautiful, kind, loving woman you are and what a happy man you have made me. Even though you love to annoy me. I promise you and your family that I will care for you and protect you no matter what difficulties we may face or how many times you say the word later or I will. I promise to continue to love, through, love you through good times as well as bad, no matter what life may bring. I know how much your father loves you and I pray that he can see the same deep love in my eyes, my actions, and my heart. And that he will find peace in knowing his precious daughter is well taken care of and loved beyond compare. You are my queen, my better half, my everything. And Sandy Lou, I will love you forever till death to us part. And in this chapter, if Adam found Eve, I will say, Philip found Sadi Lou. The world awaits. Well, let the stars tonight light the way. Hand in hand, through light or rain, it's your coming. Love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, 
It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. This love is not from our hearts, but this love is from God. woman ever on this day at this moment I promise to you that I will be very understanding to you in times of distress I will love you more in each day that will pass by when you are tired I will be your strength I will try my best not to make you sad but if you are I will be the clown to make you laugh <laughs> And I want, you, I want to be the wife that you wish for. And I promise to God, to our friends and family, that I will love you, want you, need you, care for you all the days of our lives. I do remember her saying, I do, and I looked into her eyes and I thought, wow, she challenges me, she excites me, she's dangerous, and she is fun. Dangerous! Yes. And so from that, I'm not here to talk about us, I'm here to say, Sammy, pay attention. <laughs> Philip and I are computer nerds. We analyze and troubleshoot solve problems all the day. We love to do that. We'll sit in our rooms and sit in our work and do nothing but work and work and work. I challenge you to set a budget, to save money, to make him get off his butt and travel. Go visit places. Go visit people. Visit his friends. Visit his family. Okay? This is a serious challenge. Okay? Because Bill and I won't do these things. It's because of my wife that we actually travel the world. She saves her money. She shops very carefully. And it's my challenge to you to do the same thing. Okay? Because otherwise, as you spend time together and you go and travel, your heart grows as you meet more people. And it actually strengthens the bond of your marriage. And of course, it's nice to get away to exotic places, let me tell you. So tonight, congratulations to you two. I barely met you, but I love you like a sister. And Philip is family to me, so welcome to the family. Philip, in the help of our family, we will come you to live the sign, continue to love each other, to stay together always. Congratulations and God bless. What I would like to tell you is that your marriage will remain forever. Okay? Because marriage is ordained by God. Okay? So, love one another 
until the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Huwag na agalhin mo ang gugma sa ginuto. Ika nang gugma ha, hindi ka nang gugma sa tao. Gugma na ikan ka niya. Ay bisan sa una ni mong pagdawat sa tulong sa 1 Corinthians 1.13, iyon man na once you heard the gospel of truth, din something di kang kaniya, di kang sa Diyos ni butang kanimo ang Holy Spirit na mong naibulihog pag-isap sa inyong kinabuhi the changes of your life is not your own it is the Word of God and the Holy Spirit